black heart over the last few years has become one of the most important kind of cornerstones of, I would say, the metal scene in London. Essentially, it's a, a craft beer pub that has great live music or uh, a venue that you can actually book and put gigs on where people won't just be drinking Carlin and can actually enjoy a good beer. This is where I discovered beers by breweries such as uh, Rogue Farms, Siren, um, obviously Beaver Town is always well represented. Uh, you know, you can come in here, you can discover a new band uh, and you can discover a new beer. It's, it's kind of a perfect synergy really. See, I wrote this book about black metal evolution of the cult and that was released on an American publisher. Cult Never Dies was originally just a vehicle to publish the material that hadn't made it into Evolution of the Cult. The first three books were about black metal. They were essentially the three sequels to Evolution. Then, yeah, we published uh, Doom Metal Lexicarnum, which is the only real publication on Doom Metal. It's a 300,000 word encyclopedia, essentially, by a Russian author. The most recent book that we released was uh, Mortis, uh, Secrets of My Kingdom, Return to Dimensions Unknown. If you don't know about him, it's, he's kind of a hard guy to, to sum up. He wears prosthetics, dresses up as a troll, which is already obviously a bit unusual. Um, but beyond all that, he, he was really the creator of a genre of music called Dungeon Synth. Another important aspect of Cold Never Dies is the fact that we do official merchandise for bands and a lot of it being merchandise which wasn't previously available except as bootlegs. We now do official merchandise for Ulva, Beheret, Dodheimsgard, Mysticum, you know, the list goes on. Doom Metal seems to be bigger now than it's ever been, really. Desert Fest is named after the desert rock scene, which is uh, kind of one facet of the whole sort of uh, stoner rock movement, if you like. But it's expanded way beyond that. You know, you have Hawkwind playing, you have uh, Napalm Death playing. I mean, these are bands that are just legends in their own right, really. The bands kind of speak for themselves. Monster Magnet, High on Fire, Jack Straw, bands from, you know, Doom scene, Psych scene, uh, stone and rock scene and essentially takes over Camden for three days you know it's making use of the roundhouse uh, the Camden underworld the black heart which we're sitting in now uh, the coco and uh, the dev one of the veteran alternative pubs it sprawls across Camden there's not really any aspect of doom metal or, or uh, stone or rock or sludge which isn't catered for at the festival you know, over those three days so it's, uh, it's an excellent introduction to anyone who's interested in any or all of those, uh, those subgenres. My name's Dale Patterson of Cold Never Dies Publishing. I'll see you at Desert Fest and the Black Heart in Camden. Chimba. <laughs>